going to the later rounds, RJ, how does the focus change? Um, we're still in the earlier rounds, so I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. Well, you're getting it, I mean, going beyond, going from 64 to 32. I mean, the competition only gets tougher. How does the focus change? The same focus. Um, just trying to get in there and win. We didn't have a great start to the last game, so we're just going to try to clean that up. You take a look at that photo from last night. You saw Steve Nash post it. A lot of people have been posting on social media. You, it's so funny. When you look at two guys who could be a top draft picks, you might think they're competitive. Again, we always ask you about the brotherhood, but that photo, does it really symbolize everything about the brotherhood? That picture is amazing. Um, it's like you see that picture with D-Wade and LeBron. It's, like, it's an iconic photo, and I, I hope that that picture is an iconic photo someday. But no, it just sums up how you know we really get excited and we, we really want each other to succeed, the whole team. So it's just been a great year. Going up against someone like Taco Fall, yes, he is a competitor, so he's going to say that he doesn't want Zion to dunk on him. But how much confidence do you have going against a challenge that is seven foot six? We have confidence going against anybody. Uh, he's a great player, very unique. And um, but we're just going to go in, and we're going to compete and, and try to win. And you had custom chucks, custom shoes yesterday. They had a Canadian flag on them. What does that mean to you to have a Canadian flag on your PG two point fives? That meant a lot to me. Uh, That's where. So I was born, that's where I grew up, that country really made me. So I just wanted to, to show the world that, you know, that's where I'm from, and I'm going to continue to rep them as long as I live. Thanks, Roger. Thank you.